It is from a tree that fell in Nashville during a tornado. So we have the sink, we have the mirror, we have whatever this is. We have uh, crystals we found on the property, geodes. Yeah. We've actually found this one today. There is another area. Should we show them our secret room? Hey, ready. Secret door time. Oh my goodness. Okay. <laughs> We've got a set of stairs here and they're pretty steep, so. We are careful. Careful, I've got my Crocs on, so <laughs> slippage is not an issue. <laughs> it's a lifestyle. Okay? Yep. This is our base. It's kind of like a family room. It's kind of like an office space. It's kind of like a guest bedroom. A guest right bedroom. <laughs> We've got a lot going on down here, but one thing we wanted when we were looking at a house was a finished basement. Basements are really popular out here in Tennessee. And if you do them right, you can keep them clean. You can control the humidity. Um, and you can have a sweet little setup. So on this side of the basement, we've got a little kitchenette area. Uh, it came with this very vintage, I believe it's called a Queen's, Queen's Kitchen or something yeah. like that. Queen's Cabinet. Space for all our vegetables or our tea set. <laughs> Got some counter space, which is great uh, for if we're watching movies down here. We can store popcorn, cleaning supplies. We've got a little microwave. The best fridge in the world. I know. Right? I mean, we made these in like the 90s and they're amazing. So, yeah, they're great. Got a fridge down here. Got some drinks in there, some Coke, water. It's ice. nice because it's just like a little kitchenette for guests. Yeah. They have a little space. And check out the seating area. We've got an amazing table and a booth. It's so crazy because I've been telling Missy for years how much I want a breakfast booth. Where yeah. the kids can just <laughs> sit at the breakfast booth and eat. I just think they're so cool. So this is a cool space. Oh, big storage room. Oh here. yeah, it's full. <laughs> <laughs> and then moving into this this area, we've got two chairs here, a little random table. We've got some random furniture that was left here. I don't know if this is going to stay, but it might be going to Missy's parents' place. Um, and then in this corner, we've got a bathroom. So this is really cool. Got a bathroom downstairs. Can yep. do your business without having to run upstairs. <laughs> the only thing I wish I had was a shower. Yeah. Which I feel like could go right here if the walls were. We could definitely high. add a bit of space for sure yeah okay and then this is basically our second living room and the house came with a tv it came with this it came with this all this area. furniture it's really nice leather couch <laughs> yes um the kids love it down here yeah so we've got the dvd player we've got the playstation the kids can play down here there's no internet down here and <laughs> it's made out of concrete and rebar so there's hardly any self service as well <laughs> so it's kind of a cool place to just get away and yeah in this corner, we've got Missy's desk and her iMac, so she can do work here. She can help the kiddos with homeschool. Um, and then over here, we've got a really cool corner where we actually put a king bed. Yep. Guys, we can fit a king size bed right here against <laughs> this wall. So this is where Missy's parents are staying with us um, until they get situated in their house. And maybe in the future, we may do like a Murphy bed here yeah. to free up some more space. For but sure. what an awesome place for our guests to yeah. hang out. Oh wait, don't forget the storm shelter. <laughs> yeah, I love this basement. I love that we have such a cool space for our guests to come and have space. Yeah. Eat food, entertain yourself. And check it out. This is actually a walkout basement. So we've got a slider here. You can walk right into the backyard. Here Hi Luna. <laughs> Should we go somewhere? Should I show you guys what really sold it for me? Heck yeah. Let's go. <laughs> Hang on. Driving through the front yard right now. <laughs> this is basically my drive to work every day. <laughs> <laughs> and now we have arrived at my very own personal 
music studio. <laughs> Let's go inside. <laughs> Guys, <laughs> welcome to Back Porch Studios. That's basically what I named this place because it's all about that view. You enter the studio through the back porch, and anytime you want to hang out, there's just an amazing view to take it all in, to get inspired, to get song right out there. I fell in love with this porch so much, so. Welcome to Back Porch Studios, you guys. This is cool. This is what I have dreamt about having on our property, a separate building where I can come and I can work, I can create, I can sing, I can record, I can write, I can do everything my heart desires. And check it out, you guys. They left all this. <laughs> well, I've got a mix of my equipment in here, but I basically got a full recording studio out of this. Yep. Got a great desk here, a lot of outboard gear. Um, I've got an awesome friend and engineer who's helping me get it all hooked up, which is really nice. Look, you've um, hung your YouTube. <laughs> yeah, we've got our old uh, YouTube subscriber buttons up there. I want to put this. I want to put this photo of Elvis up here. I think. Yeah. You can look at that. That would be cool. Yeah, yeah, I like that. So I'm still working on that. Um, I love that we've got a nice big closet for all of our gear. Yep. So we've got lots of microphones, headphones microphone stands, all that fun stuff. And of course you've got the recording desk, focal monitors, which sound amazing. Even and little windows. We've got a vocal booth right here. So it's a little I can see out through the windows. I can talk to someone at the table. I can talk to someone in the room. I can see the view and I can record right here. Like this, this is amazing. I cannot wait to record. Oh, right here. this, this view so is just cool. so cool. <laughs> the fact that you can see the backyard from it. I too. know, I know. <laughs> so that is the vocal booth. And then we've got a really big wall here with some panels on it. What's cool is these actually slide right off. And then we have a big wall space for projectors for yep. movie night. Which they do all the time. So the boys play, love it. <laughs> we play Super Smash Brothers. We watch DVDs in here all the time. Four big swivel chairs. So this is great for meetings, songwriting. Oh yeah. Um, hanging out. I may there eventually put a couch in here at some point, but I really like these chairs. Yeah, we would love to make this like a place where like people can also stay as well if it's yeah. a pullout couch, but yeah. yeah. Um, we got a lot of gear, so bear with me. I'm moving in, okay? <laughs> I kind of stashed all my production gear under here. Um, and it actually came with this really cool cabinet which has got doors here and drawers here. Holds a lot of stuff. Yeah. Microwave, which I haven't used yet. It's clean. It is clean. <laughs> um, the recording sign from, of course, my old music studio in California. I've got some touring gear. I've got my PC computer I have to set up. And of course, I've got the elephant in the room. This <laughs> <laughs> won't let me put this in the house. So. <laughs> She's like, you're going to hang this up in your studio, right? Yeah, it was already at the studio before. <laughs> <laughs> it's my grams, so I can't get rid of it. No. And then look at this wood wall. I know. So pretty. Kind of crazy because we had a wood wall like this in our old bedroom. You remember mm -hmm. that? And again, floor to ceiling windows everywhere. So we get a ton of natural light. But these are really cool. These are called uh, acoustic curtains. And they're soundproofing and light blocking. Very cool. They're green, which I thought they would be great for a green screen. <laughs> I don't know about that. All the shadows and stuff. Yeah. It is my favorite color. So it gets pitch dark in here. Yeah. Lots of privacy. Really cool. And uh, what an amazing space. This I sold just, it. I, I saw this. <laughs> I saw the pasture and I saw this building and I was just in complete disbelief. Yep. And then even when we were talking to the realtor, he was talking about it like it was a possibility. I was like, wait, there's a chance. I don't we didn't know believe how it. We got so lucky to be in a place like this or to find something that literally had everything we wanted. Well, and it's crazy because of course a music studio would be a dream, but we didn't actually think that would ever be a option. I thought I'd have to build it myself. <laughs> yeah. After building my own studio in California. Yeah. So. Saying goodbye to that place was really hard, but I feel like it just led me here yep. to my own space.
And there you have it, you guys. That is our new house tour. We are so excited to be in this place. I know. We have so much more we want to show you, huh? Yeah. yeah. <laughs> There's so much cool things on the property. I want to show you all the things I caught and all the cool places there are. Yeah. <laughs> totally. So you guys are going to have to stay tuned. There's definitely more. We want to give you guys a full tour of our property and everything outside. But yeah. That's it for the house. Let us know what you guys think down below in the comments. And be sure to hit that thumbs up button because Daily Bumps is finally in a house. Yeah. Finally. I feel like it's been years in the making to get to this point. So, so cool. exciting. We're so happy. <laughs> stay tuned. We have lots of fun stuff coming up. Lots of fun videos to show you guys. So. Make sure you're subscribed if you aren't. Yep. And go check out my new song, Moves Like You, just released just in time for summer. There's a link down below in the description. So go check that out. And we'll see you guys in our next video. Yeah. Yeah. yeah.